TV advantage. Hopefully, hopefully he's only got 10k and he won't buy a wizard. The good thing about pro tips ogres is nobody's gonna fucking scum a wizard, are they? Really? Because gonna, <laughs> they'll probably just get an apple and they're like, oh, you can't get an apple. A fucking Igor or a couple of babes, I guess. But, um, they always oh, got journeyman. All right, fair enough. Um, obviously, Claw is a bit terrifying for ogres. Gonna have to make sure that he, uh, he doesn't get easy claw hits on the ogres. But he's only got 11 men, so if we win the toss, might just be a little bang on him. <laughs> to be fair though, I can see the point in the plus AV. I'm not saying that I would take plus AV. But Hitano Gashi on Fumble, he's a pretty good player. And he he would take he used to take AV on his skinks, not the good ones. But on like the random skinks. Because it is a huge difference between armor seven or armor eight. And obviously Necro uh what's it called? Um They don't have... Oh God, I can't fucking speak English here. They don't actually have... <laughs> I'm struggling. Um, like, obviously you want good skinks. But after you've got good skinks... Um... And like and ghouls don't have an apple, do they? Ghouls don't have an apple. That's what I was trying to think of, yeah. Ghouls don't actually have an apple, so they can't take that. Where's his whites? Uh, a blodger and a blodger could be a pit. Mighty blow, obviously a real pain. Block a mighty blow. I just don't him to claw ogres. And then I can blitz him down and foul him and it'll be alright. Plymouth Argyle, the unrivaled. I mean, even casting a snot isn't the end of the day. I mean, it's a guaranteed cas of a snot when he blitzes, but. You know, what can you do? <laughs> yeah, Tom Jordy, yeah. Yeah, look, I can see the I can see the argument for him. And he's a good coach, you know, he was, wasn't an idiot. He wasn't an idiot just taken or well, idiot's harsh anyway. He wasn't a person somebody bad at Blood Bowl taking because he was bad at Blood Bowl. He already had like you know, if you already have like say a movement ten skink and an agility four skink or whatever, um just like the line skinks he would take plus A V because it's a huge difference between armor seven and armor eight, and uh, you know that's it. And and it's it is a huge difference for for ghouls without an apple. I can see why somebody would do it, but um, and especially with having wolves to do your one turn anyway. So getting a, a, like a a werewolf with movement nine would be a much better one turn prospect than a than a ghoul with plus like with movement eight, wouldn't it? So. I can kind of I can see the point, but I obviously I don't agree with it. But I wouldn't just say it's outright completely fucking terrible like taking two vampires is. Um 
How long great to get in? Yeah, August. <laughs> Crazy. Hopefully, well, hopefully it won't be a good match. Hopefully I'll just fucking ruffle stomp him. Yeah, also, yeah, skills. Also, yeah, skinks. The key thing is skinks don't have good skills, do they? They literally have sidestep, and that's about it. So, yeah. Oh, baby. Say hello to some fuckhead ogres. He can't even hit with his with his fucking things, can he? Wolves. Yes, exactly, yeah, Shattered Eyes. Yeah, to be fair, okay, it's a lot better on it. It's a lot better on this game. <laughs> but still, I can see... I can see why people... People could like it without being terrible. Like, people could like extra arms on a... Uh, on a... Uh, on a Beastman and not be terrible, you know? Plus AG on an ogre. Um, I don't know. I mean, it makes it makes the pickup easier. It makes dodging kind of harder because you could just have break tackle. So, but obviously, if you get like dodge and everything and sure hands, then it's you can have a good ogre carry. But it's a long route. Yeah, you you can't like to you can't like to you you can't be good at the game and like two vamps on a vampire team. You just can't like it just doesn't work, does it? There's no way. There's no argument for that. See, this is this is the problem with ogres and why stand firm is actually pretty good because people just try to block you away, don't they? Try to, people uphill you, especially with block. Ball carrier. Oh shit! This is the problem with the, with the dodge. He's gonna get a dodge around and hit skinks, isn't he? Well, not that effectively. Ha ha ha! Take the skull. Oh <laughs> Goliath! I was I was bribed to play ogres to try and qualify with ogres. In fact, um. And and that's what I'm trying to do. Three one zero, <laughs> pretty good. <laughs> Way better start than the chaos had. Hey, fuck you, mighty blow block guy. Oh man, <laughs> just do it! <laughs> wow, the auto pathing ma makes me make a a, a, five, a five plus four plus dodge instead of just going in like this. Isn't that stupid? That's good. That's good auto pathing cyanide. Well done. Hmm. 
I don't build one dice really. I don't know what to do here. I just don't have, don't have roll any boneheads. <laughs> After all, that one. He's blodged, he can probably just dodge around and get hits on the ball anyway. Uh, on a ball on the snot. Maybe blitz him and then try to put some pressure on. Run these guys through. Make this 2D first. If it's a pow, it's pretty good, isn't it? <laughs> Snotling wall. I mean, he hasn't really got many players to play with here. I could move this this ogre back as a sweeper, I guess. And I quite like shutting down the mighty blow block. The sure feet knob is on is on the bench shattered ice to be the ball carrier. Nine guys still no pitch invasion. <laughs> well, holy boy. <laughs> the game usually doesn't balance it out by the end, does it? Blood Bowl, the game, balances out by the end. But Blood Bowl on an individual match level does not even close to balance out by the end. <laughs> That's the problem, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, play chess. <laughs> okay, no. Oh, wow, that was smart of him. He didn't even three dice him. Oh, I want to go there so I can surf him. But I can't, can I? Oh, I could have done. I thought I thought it was me too. Oh god, I fucked up. What? What? I don't know what happened there. I was just fucking. I, my head was away with the fairies. Then I don't know what happened. You only lost that game in the head. That's what I was thinking, BCL. That's what I wanted to say. You only lost that game in your head, and instead I just did what I did there. Oh god, he's, if he fails this. His, his fucking ghoul is getting fucked. This is brilliant. Yeah, it depends. And just because he's a just because he's a level one, it doesn't mean he's bad. He could just be new to Blood Bowl too. And um, but yes, obviously, if you quit, you're never going to win. Obviously. But, um, you know, you can't really bag on somebody if for conceding there, can you at all? Different if you were top, if you were top, uh, but on the other hand, if you had the top team and you were playing Christopher or whatever, like, like Ducky just conceded straight away against Christopher, didn't he? You know, if, you, if, if that's different, but um, 
I don't know. There's, there's, it's not. It's not easy. It's not cut and dry to say something. But you might just not want to bother. You know, shadow dice. That's the thing. If you if you if you've got like a good record, and exactly a level one coach doesn't mean he's bad. It could be like you know, Spartaco was about level four or something in the World Cup, wasn't he? And uh, he was the best player in the World Cup, so. He just made a. He just rolled a dice there. It's pretty good, wasn't it? <laughs> a fucking idiot rolling dice in Blood Bowl. Wait, I've got to roll dice for every action. Shit. I've got a hit from there, haven't I? Oh, he's down. Oh, fuck. It's got to be a GFI. And then one, two, three, four, five. So he's got to go. Hmm. Shit, dodge is gone. I've got to go for it. All right, I really don't want to make a GFI over here. So I guess I just don't. I guess I just walk over there, right? Tagging his wolf would be good. Yeah, exactly. If it was later in a run, if you already had a good record, obviously you're going to stick it out. Because it's not over. It's obviously not over. Just having a horrific nine-man stunned pitching invasion. It's really not the end of the world. But if you're not going to enjoy it, then why the fuck not concede? I'm absolutely fine with people conceding like that. Fine, <laughs> Smokey. <laughs> oh, wow. That's rough, V-Power. Can all level look? <laughs> it wasn't it? Did the AV do a thing? Holy shit! It did as well. Fuck. I thought about going through to tag that wolf, but then it's getting six dice and a snot, isn't it? Which isn't that good. Now I've got the safety. You can always try and chuck him as well. Oh, he's not blitzing with frenzy. <laughs> Okay. Oh, lucky bastard. Lucky fucking bastard. Two TZs, not bad. He didn't blitz with frenzy. What a madman. Oh wow. <laughs> this is next level. Four plus pickup isn't even bad. One, two, three, four, five, double GFI. 
It's not even hard. I don't know, probably some kind of auger, V power, um, brick farth or whatever. Yeah, I think chef's shit to be honest. Ah, oh, you bastard. Try to block with him, and then if he goes stupid, blitz with the break tackle guy. I just didn't want to risk a bonehead here last time. Because obviously, two players <laughs> taking up four is pretty good. Now this guy can get through. Double GFI. And then I could blitz him with two dice. One, two, three, four, yeah. Two dice blitz to clear the tackle zone. To make it a four plus pickup instead of a three. Mm. He could just GFI by himself because he's a foot and he's a fucking ogre as well. That seems that seems like a better thing to do. Right, so a GFI, and then a dodge, and then a two dice blitz, and then a pick up and some GFIs to score. Gotta re roll the GFI. Oh, baby. No, I can't go in the way because I have to make another dodge. Oh well. Double GFI. So I guess I don't pick, don't reroll the pickup. But if I do, then I reroll the GFI. If I make the pickup, I reroll the GFI. I guess I could try and just protect it back here, but then these guys can just dodge away and get it. Alright, if I'd have used the reroll, I'd have just stayed there and hoped that he got a push so I could sidestep in. But I, I gotta go on him up, haven't I? Oh, you can't. Maybe I shouldn't use the reroll to do it. Maybe I should have just stood there, or maybe I should have. Um, maybe I should have just tried to protect it a bit. But still, I'll take a touchdown on his drive. <laughs> I 
<laughs> There'll be a few people thinking ogres are overpowered, won't they? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have pushed my luck with the second GFI. Because he had no reroll, so he was only 50% to get me down. If he didn't get me down, I sidestep in the end zone. Which is good. If he did get me down, maybe the ball goes out. Maybe they wouldn't have scored, I don't know. Oh, P. <laughs> Easy to all the powers. <laughs> the power of the corners. <laughs> I was shocked that I made the GFI. I would have rerolled the GFI to get there. I thought I would just double GFI into three dice the uh, wolf just because it would be fun, wouldn't it? <laughs> hopefully, Tony, hopefully. That would be alright, wouldn't it? He's, he's there, ready to throw. Or, you know. Go there. In fact, this one I'd just throw, wouldn't he? Throw it. Pick it up. Score. God, that would be amazing, wouldn't it? Yeah. But it's the one in six to use your reroll as well, isn't it, Shadow Dice? But yeah, it, I guess it was worth. I could have also just tried to defend. I could have tried to like cage a bit and stuff. Uh, not yet, Clangers. No, I haven't tried one yet, to be fair. Haven't had to try because they've just because they've just banged on people really on the on on defense. No one scored on turn eight against these. In fact I think only Oh no, the Goblins scored in like two turns, didn't they? The Ogres conceded, the Goblins scored in, t in two turns, uh, the other one was a 2 0 win, and then the draw was 1 1, but he scored on my drive. So yeah, no one, no one stalled out the drive to even have the chance of a turn eight, one turn. Yes, that's that exactly Shattered Ice as well, yeah. And just the one in six, not having not having the safety net also sucks, doesn't it? If he fails to pick up here, it could go in the crowd, couldn't it? Not that unlikely. Yeah, he's obviously just going to three dice. He's not actually going to get three dice. Wow. Wow, he doesn't know how assists work, so that's good for me. He is he's new to Blood Bowl, isn't he? Could send a send an, an aerial aerial snotling threat here. Ah oh, shit. Oh, man, I don't even need a break tackle, do I? One, two, three, four, five. GFI, GFI. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, I kind of have to, just because it's fun. Should have done safe moves first, shouldn't I actually? I just couldn't wait to, to block his mighty blow. White down. There's an argument for just basing the ball here, isn't there? I really just want to double GFI to get him. Toss the snotling in for support. Could be the play, to be honest. No, oh, I failed. I tried. I tried to throw the snot in for support. <laughs> Alright, 
let's go. Oh, there's another double one after it as well. Maybe it should have gone there, right? I don't know why I went that way. More chance of scoring. Yeah, good thing I didn't have a reroll the waste, yeah. Yeah. Ah, maybe I shouldn't have done such a rowdy move against him. Cause he's probably gonna give me oh, he's giving me the same chance again, hasn't he? Three, four, five, just one GFI this time. Oh he's gonna pass, holy shit. Oh, reroll. All right, pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, I definitely shouldn't have done something as rowdy as that. I was a bit dumb. Could go in here and then um, get a scatter, I guess. He wants to do the recovery though, doesn't he? The scatter, what, what happens with the scatter? If it's a push, then five of them are bad, three of them are really good. Well, three of them are good. If it's a pow, I can just hit from the side, then I can choose. So if it's a push, I push into there, and if it's a pow, I'll go there. Because then if it's a pow, hmm, oh, I'm going to go this way anyway, and then I can think about it. Probably just want to clear it, don't I, and go for the four plus pickup. Yeah, definitely now. Definitely now, just take the push. Yeah, stick with one reroll, yeah. Sponsor and Batman. <sighs> with other Rogue, I don't think so. He couldn't go anywhere super relevant, could he? But he could bonehead. Like, it would be better if he was in a way, but then even then, if he moved here, he could stand him and one dice him. I think it was, I think he's in a pretty good spot, old Shawnee there, just chilling out, staring, staring at this white on the ground. <laughs> yeah, I think the scatter probably wasn't worth. Definitely not with a push, because it was pretty much guaranteed to be in one tackle zone, wasn't it? With a power, I might have gone for the scatter. Just because three of them are great. And these two aren't even that bad. 
this probably isn't that bad. These two are, are actually probably better. Well, that was a pretty unlucky pickup attempt, wasn't it, to come out there after scattering from here. That was really unlucky, to be honest. Really unlucky pickup attempt. Block. Pretty good at killing snots. Yeah, I shouldn't have got so rowdy with hitting the, two, the double G if I had hit the ball. It was probably a bit crazy. <laughs> Bam. Well, 1-1 one, one at half time isn't bad, is it? Can 2-1 grind him? I'd like to fucking remove a player. I guess I'll just go ham on blocking people now. Four plus two plus to hit the ball. It's not even bad. I've blocked my way, haven't I? Uh -huh. That was the dice roll I needed. Right, one, two, three, four, five, GFI. Four plus two plus, not even that bad. I could try and throw this snotling at him first, maybe. Means one of these getting blocked or just doing the two dice though. Both could go on the crowds. I don't really want to move either of these two, that's the thing. There you go, did that failed. <sighs> Bollocks. They were doing a good job just not activating the uh, ogres <laughs> and then activating fuck them. Would have been good though to get this the break tackle one down. Maybe I shouldn't have moved him. I'm assuming maybe I should have just moved him. Mm. You could definitely feel something. Don't the ogre. <laughs> oh man. 
Oh, he hit that which blocked us the dodge out. Shit. The fuck head. That's annoying that that stops the 4 plus dodge to sack, doesn't it? I should have gone for that last turn. And that GFI that I shouldn't have made was a 5, so if I'd just fucking gone for the, the, gone for the play, would have made it and then got the both down on the, uh, on the, uh, thing. Taking a while, isn't he? Oh, wow, red dice. Motherfucker. I'm definitely going to throw a snarling at the, at the ball. That's definitely happening, finally. Who can possibly reach him? He can GFI twice to tag him. He can GFI twice to tag him. One, two, three, four, five, GFI, GFI twice to tag him. So actually I probably don't want to uh, throw. Only this one could get thrown and then he's probably not going to do anything. Can't, can't do it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. Right, so one, two, GFI, GFI. I'm double double marking. Which is something, isn't it? No, I can't. I guess it was dumb. It was a 1 in 9, wasn't it? I should have gone for the 1 in 36. I don't know, the 1 in 6 GFIs, though. I thought it'd take out the air. The guy who could who would blitz them. Right, maybe 2-1. Got the chance of the uh, throw teammate. Oh, there was a chance of a throw teammate with him. But, um, something happened. Oh, there was Nurgle. I did get a chance against the Nurgle, the throw teammate. But, um, I avoided disturbing presence. And but Phil actually didn't just thought I avoided it. Should have fouled maybe towards the end. No point having reserves unused, is there? I can't believe I've done nothing to them. The other games I've just wrecked them, haven't I? A million cars, and then this is just nothing's happened.
I think the odds are so low that I'm just going to focus on um, focus on the LOS blocks anyway. Two, three, four, five, GFI, GFI. Oh, this looks like something, doesn't it? Good enough for me. Yeah, exactly. So I've got both. That's why I've got both Tony and uh, Shattered Eyes. So of course, now you see, if it, I could have gone GFI to hand off to him and then thrown from the LOS, or I could go GFI, hand off to him and then thrown from there. So I was hedging my bets a little bit, which I thought was a good idea. Two, three, four, five. So you can come around for the block. One, two, three, four, five, yeah. Relying on one ogre to do the pass now, but doesn't matter too much, does it? I guess I could have done a blitz and tried to like chain him forward. Chain him forward one might have been the idea. Hello, Senai eighty nine. Uh, it's going, it's going pretty well, especially considering it's fucking ogres. Oh no, the other, the other ogre could have GFI to try and throw. He's got a chance. <laughs> one for one. Pretty good. <laughs> Ogre powered, aren't they? <laughs> Just now she says it, isn't it? Thanks for the bits, won't we? <laughs> That's fucking crazy. Waiting for opponent. Oh no, black screen. Is he gonna concede in disgust? I'd be okay with that. I'm not gonna lie, it's gonna be hard to protect the ball against fucking movement eight frenzy guys and the blood block guy and a mighty blow block guy yes he disconnected fingers crossed fingers crossed <laughs> thanks for the bits quick scope and jfk oh wow <laughs> yeah maybe maybe he did oh no he's not he's back 
you <laughs> taking the correct two or good pill. <laughs> yeah, one turn again, it's safe. No, the one the one removal came back. Oh, that's a shame. I re I was really hoping he'd rage quit. <laughs> Maybe try just carry with a carry with an ogre. Because with Blodge he's gonna be able to get the ball, isn't he? One turn again. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy now, Nani. <laughs> I scored pretty early, turn three or four or something on his drive, but then he equalised and then one turned it. Yeah, block over carrier seems pretty good, doesn't it? Because I don't care when I score. Because 3 1 is a win, isn't it? Probably. AV8 has done a thing as well, yeah. Kept him on the pitch, didn't it? <laughs> oh, unfortunate last frog, man. It was pretty glorious. It's probably my first one turn touchdown with Olgas as well. From like, from a reception. I haven't played that many games with him. About 20, no, about 30 maybe games with Olgas in my life. This was a pretty good setup, I thought, because if it's. If it's in the danger zone, then I don't really need him because I don't know if it was there. He could GFI, couldn't he? Maybe these guys should have been wider so they could have gone back and then around. Maybe he should have been back further. But then they could just go diagonally as well. It's interesting, isn't it? But I like that there were different chances to score. With it. Yeah, don't even have to score. True. And that's true as well, Wolfpark. But. If I carry with a snotling, it's just too easy to turn me over, isn't it? So I think, while well, I don't have to score. Also, if I carry with a block, then I'm not getting to block with him. And he can only uphill. Nah, he could uphill with a... The dodge white can just uphill him pretty easily, can't he? That's the problem. Carrying with a break tackle guy would mean a level for him if he scored. But I just... You know, it's given up reliable blocks, isn't it? To carry with a block. Good though, isn't it? <laughs> Makes it hard for him to get the ball off us. Oh yeah, bench an ogre as well to try and increase the chances of, you know, increase the field coverage of getting the kick. Obviously there's the blitz. Three dices. Still got time to think about it anyway. Hmm. I just not blocking with block seems dumb, doesn't it? A whole half of not blocking with block. Yeah, half halfling trees, yeah, are the best. Halflings, yeah. By a mile, strong arm makes it less likely to uh, fumble, and they don't have loner as well, and they don't bonehead. So, it's they just they just way better. They don't like they don't have a critical failure of a one, like the others have. Even without, even if they had loner, they just they're just better because if they take root, it doesn't literally doesn't it doesn't stop you throwing, does it? So the the biggest thing. It's not even the loner. It's the uh it's the uh things. Oh yeah, snots are better at dodging though, yeah that's true. Oh yeah, that's true, Wolfpark, yeah that's true. But then and goblins are faster, aren't they? So it's interesting. Goblins have an extra move. Hmm. Dunno, I imagine though, I imagine taking away a two plus that you've got to make is is pretty good, isn't it? I don't, really, I like, don't like the idea of just not blocking with block all the time. Because you can make the blitz, the blocker a blitz every single turn, can't he? It's like super reliable. And then he could dodge this go, fuck it, I'm going to do it, I'm going to do it, I'm going to try and get the break tackle. It levels him up and it, uh, and it gets the block used all the time. Ah, oh, yeah, that's true, Wolfbark, yeah, that's true. That's true, yeah. 
that's true. Good point. Oh shit. Oh god, it's the it's the hor horrific <laughs> it's the horrific ogres bunched together, no ogres back set up. Oh fuck me. Yeah, the troll's way worse because in the troll's another two plus uh, one two plus to not eat him, isn't he? So I know he can escape, but yeah, yeah, it's it's way yeah it's way worse. Yeah. Well, you'd have to math it out, wouldn't you? You would have to have it mathed out under kind of like optimal conditions. But even then, optimal conditions could mean that. The goblins can cover the field better than the halflings can. And uh, so that's something as well, isn't it? Like goblins are going to have chances to, to score when halflings don't. Yeah, the, go the goblin can escape. It's a, it's a, on a one he tries to eat him and then another one he does eat him, isn't it? So it's a one in 36 to eat the goblin. I'm pretty sure. Having Brogus stuck on fleshies is pretty annoying, isn't it? Let's his lets his whites run rampant. Alright, not if he just lets me punch them. <laughs> But even if they escape, you still can't throw them, can you? So it's a two plus to be able to throw, which is pretty, pretty bad. Wow, he's not pressuring the walls. Pretty good. covered first of all um, two dice with block Don't risk that one. Don't let them run through straight away. Right, need this to not be a fucking both down, eh? Oh, I could maybe blitz with him. Oh. No, because this is too dodgy, this, this guy coming out. I've got to keep somebody here, haven't I? I still can. Alright, so blitz with him. Guard as well, isn't he? Very nice to get him in there. Of course, he goes stupid. So 
and after two dice to knock him over. Maybe I just shouldn't have activated him, eh? Fuck's sake. Maybe I just shouldn't have activated him once I got him in there. Because he was doing his job of occupying the mighty blow guy. Oh, what a dickhead. What a pure dickhead. <laughs> That's good barbecue stuff. Oh, that was an annoying, that was an annoying bone. I just shouldn't have done it, but I just had to try and kill his fucking white, didn't I? Oh, he just won dice with a white. Brilliant. Brilliant. Didn't, didn't three dice block Mighty Blower Snotling? Good for him. Phew. It's funny that I've twice tried to, uh, twice tried to throw a goblin, a nobbler at somebody. But I failed both times, but thank God it worked on the one turn. Yeah, it's just it's just making safe moves first and stuff though, isn't it? It's like obviously sometimes you're gonna have to risk it, but it's just annoying that he's still got a full team, to be honest. I would have liked to have got some removals. With all that mighty blow, I know he's got regen, but still. <laughs> yeah, six mighty blows, no one removals, exactly. Six strength, five mighty blow. I wouldn't have minded some removals. It's hard to deal with when they've got a full team, isn't it? I can't. Right, so got the reroll's got to be on blitzing that, blitzing that werewolf, hasn't it? He hasn't needed region. Like I just haven't hurt anyone. So, like, <laughs> if I had, region might have been a thing, but I just haven't. Yep. Not good. Try throw it. No, I can't. I couldn't throw him first, really. Oh wow, Gia finally get three diced. Gotta base the ball. Take percent of the time works every time, yeah. If you imagine one of them is dead, your power gets plus two one. Jimmy. <laughs> Hello, Henry. <laughs> ah. I mean, I could just two plus away, one in thirty six away, but. I think I wouldn't mind three dicing, you know, fish for the pal, maybe take him out, because the, the having dodge is really, really a pain in the ass, isn't it? Yeah, I'm totally going to, totally going to try and just power him. If he's powered, it's really good, isn't it?
Okay, so that's that's him recovered, him recovered. Get the power. No removals, of course. Maybe I could foul him. Seems a bit fucking nuts though. Get banged on you little shit. Ah, boo. He might surf that all the might he, but could throw the snot next turn, maybe? Hmm, maybe not. Jimmy is not suitable for kids, yeah I'm, I'd say to be fair. <laughs> there is the warning at the start of the stream, isn't it? Augury should be... Something should be cheaper. I think I do have terrible frames in this game. Yeah, a lot of Q, yeah. Could give them, um... Yeah, I know, but I mean, it might be, mightn't it? That's what, that's what I'm saying. I'm not, I'm not thinking of it as plan A. Um, but it, that, it's good that it's an option, isn't it? If everything does go wrong, that you have the option. It's good to have the option, isn't it? But though it's not much of an option yet, because it's just not far forward enough yet. It was a literal capitulation, super winning. Bribery. Bribery and corruption at its finest. And hits the snot. Doesn't get him though. <laughs> get banged on. That was a good sidestep, wasn't it? Because now that's a guy, he can't assist the block on the Olga from there. I guess he will block down that Olga now. Can't block with his wolf because he'd frenzy into. Frenzy in one uphill. Yep. Splits down in the air, so that auger isn't getting surfed at least. Done V power. Holy shit. Hey, he won in nine. He didn't fucking die though, did he? He could have died. That would have made things easier. Right, this guy could blitz. And then get get further up the pitch. Quite quite a way up further up the pitch, actually, here. This could be a really good turn. Famous last words. But it could be. <laughs> two dice on a thing, two dice on a thing, two dice on a thing, three dice on a thing here. Yes, finally a removal. Turn 11. I 
I want the real tackle zones and the... Uh... Oh god, there's a fucking wolf there. Fuck. I just have to be back down, so he's going to make two dodges in. Maybe I have to not activate him. Three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. Yeah, maybe he just doesn't get activated so that he doesn't fail. And maybe the same here, just it just the failure is so bad, isn't it? Like a bonehead just opens this up. A bonehead here opens this up. Just end the turn in fear. Born one in nine didn't die, never lucky. I liked him to have died. <laughs> He's already dead, yeah, okay, fair. God, wolves are bad times for fucking snotling carriers, aren't they? Holy shit. Maybe I should have uh, run this ogre forward and tried to hand off to him. Maybe that would have been the play. Maybe that was definitely the play, actually. Wow, he's gone for the fucking. Oh, he's gone for the one dicer. Oh, he deserves to skull this out, doesn't he? Oh, triple skulls! <laughs> Will it be my first ever quad skulls that I've ever seen? That'd be good. No. He took them both down! <laughs> <laughs> he, took, he took the board down on no balls. <laughs> Magic. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. There's actual opportunity now, isn't there? Mm hmm. That's a really annoying bonehead, though. Should have gone there because now he can dodge in there. Oh god, that was a really bad. That was really bad. That was not. A, that was a not playing ogres thing to do there. That was really bad. He should have been there, hundred percent. I was thinking if I've got ogres, it's like having guard on the corners. You know how people say have guard on the corners. He can just uphill push him in getting two dice now as well. Oh god. Um Because then he's you know, I was thinking if I make a cage, he's gotta dodge into a tackle zone then at least. Okay, not three tackle zones like you would have to have as a real cage, but still having to dodge into one is still better than none, isn't it? <laughs>
sex as the wrestlers. <laughs> That's brilliant. That's actually brilliant, that. Sex as the wrestlers. Oh, that was so bad though, that extra square forward, because if this is a if this is, if he like if he rolls a three on this dodge in, it's cause I fucked it up, isn't it? So bad, got in the wrong square. Fucking speed! It's it's bad that the 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 prone wolf moves the same speed as my standing <laughs> fucking snot. It is, it is where I'm supposed to say I deserve to lose, but I've still got fucking ogres. So, um... So, you know, I don't think you deserve to lose with Ogres. That was a wall. So, he, it, luckily, he didn't go for the, the 3 plus dodge in that he had. He went for the user reroll to make a 4 plus 1. And was it was it a 3? That's interesting, isn't it? It was a 3. So, if he'd gone for the proper play of the ghoul dodge in, he would have made it. Um, but he didn't. Break tackle. Surf. <gasps> Oof. Could block him. Oh man, he's tempting me here, isn't he? He's fucking tempting me here. Could just throw him and score. Like, seeing as he's got the ball, throwing him for the touchdown isn't bad now. You need to get four squares forward. Safely. Walk him, blitz him. Walk him. Get him out. Yeah. Right, squeezing him against the sideline is good because he's got dodge. No, no, I wanted to hand off to him. Oh, holy shit, I'm so fucked now. One, two, three, four, five.
that was not the turn I needed three boneheads. I don't even want to fucking give him this guy to move in and base him. Yeah, there was no way to do it. I mean, I could have, I could have made GFIs to get out here, but it was, uh, it was bad. A turn needed for that was a turn and re this one was really crucial because you know I could have blitzed him and then gone an eye cage and hand it off to him but I couldn't use the I would have had the, to use the reroll on the handoff not the uh, not the bonehead so Yeah, maybe I could have used it, but that's, I just hate re-rolling a bonehead because then you don't have the re-roll for the act. Like, you know, the, the play would have been to re-roll the bonehead, blitz him, and then hand it off to him, but I couldn't fucking do it, could I? If I'd re-rolled the bonehead here, first of all, it would have been a one, but it would have been a two dice block without block, so... I would have used it if I'd failed anything. But unfortunately, with not failing... And uh, I do not use. When I didn't actually fail anything did I that was the problem it was just the fucking bonehead so there weren't turnovers so I'm not going to reroll something that wasn't a turnover maybe I shouldn't have given him a block but then I thought at least if he's blocking he's just blocking and not not you know going to a better spot or whatever oh he's worse than pretty shit try but it's still fucking ogres, isn't it? <laughs> so it's still, just quietly, it's still really fucking hard to do anything. I need him to commit the uh, ghoul and then I can do the breakaway potato throw, can't I? Instead, he's fucking bringing back him to be the... Oh, God, he's got the perfect sweeper instead. What a shithead. I guess I just go for the handoff, but I can't because he's fucking boneheaded. Oh, God. That's the absolute worst that he's boneheaded. Oh, man. Worst time to be boneheaded ever. Hey. All right. So, could block him and power him, or blitz him and power him, and then could hand off to him, and then he could potato. I think handing off to this ogre is, is the play at this point. 
Or I could just go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Go to here, throw him. Hope he lands. Block him. No, he's got guys there. This is tough. If I block him and free him up, then hand it off to him. Blitz one of them. Screen. I mean, that, that's a pretty good handoff to him. Obviously, if I fail this 4+, plus, it's horrific. Maybe I just don't hand off. Maybe I just cage up. Ogre cage. 1, 2, 3, 4. Oh, yeah, just an ogre cage, isn't it? All right. Now we're talking. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. All right. Pretty shit. Maybe I should have re-rolled that bonehead and then tried to run through. But I like the idea of giving it to a giving it to an ogre. <laughs> No, Smokey, the Ogres and an Ogre team don't have it. That would have been pretty safe if the, if the last one hadn't boneheaded. If he blitzed him, powered him, and then I'd had an Ogre cage, that would have been pretty strong. I think. Fucking Johnny. And smashed to pieces. Chill out, sit. <laughs> 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 I guess it's not going to be a loss. At least there is that. <laughs> now, Shawnee, now, now. <laughs> oh, that fucking bonehead was a killer. Double bonehead as well from him. Maybe I should have appoed it. Ah, appoed it. Fucking, you know, re-rolled that. Because if he had, if he had blitzed and then was stood here, it's not even, it wouldn't have been that safe to be fair. It's not. Like... I'd like the handoff to him though. That would have been pretty. That would maybe would have been better. Blitz, go into the cage, and then hand it off to him. 
He makes his four plus. Fuckhead. Hmm. No. Is there a flesh golem there? Yeah. Not much I can do about that, is there? Double one the dodge. Just couldn't get couldn't get the throwing. Well a draw's not bad, is it? I guess I want one in nine. He still. I can't believe he just did all that play without a reroll. By the way, four plus pick up, four plus pass. All I had to do was do the four plus handoff to a fucking. Maybe I shouldn't have done it because he didn't have the reroll. I mean, maybe I shouldn't have put the ball on the ground on purpose, even if it was a one in four. I was gonna. He was gonna go, and then he was gonna throw him at him. He was gonna blitz, and then base the ball. Herb dirt base, base, base was the was the idea. He stalled the first half, so I don't think he'll. I don't think he'll score this turn. There's no pressure on, is there? Two failed pickups would be good. Oh man, there's a chance. You're telling me there's a chance. <laughs> Alright, well, he can blitz and then there's no dodge, isn't there? This one. All right, good shot, hit me. <laughs> no. I could have got him in somewhere, couldn't it? One, two, three, four, five. Double GFI, that would have been really good. Could have just got could have got the power there and he could have double GFI'd to there. Still half a chance. There's a chance of a win. <laughs> Shit. Not much chance. It's a one in thirty six block, isn't it? That fucking bonehead, man, he just bonehead at every turn, didn't he? It's 
So it means a 1 in 36 block, but then there's still a 1 in 3. 1 in 3 to win. Yes. Hey, hey, hey. <sighs> okay, now. <laughs> okay, now. What a match. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> okay, now. Oh, yeah. MVP the the guard. I I thought the uh, block guy would have got MVP after that fucking performance. Bonehead seventy eight wasn't even that bad overall. It was just that one particular guy. Let's go, August. <laughs> Ogre power. It feels he didn't score only because he couldn't pick up two turns. That's true, I'll out but I also didn't pick it up with the four plus with a reroll. I had a four plus handoff and only had to do it because of two of double double two two bonehead fails in a row is what made me try a four plus handoff which failed with a reroll, which then he had no rerolls and did a four plus pickup and a four plus pass into a three plus catch. So, you know, he, he, he played it badly, didn't he? If he played it better, he would have won. I mean, he would have drawn. Well, he would have won if he played it better. The Dodgers were on point, 92%. Um, pretty good. But, yeah, the, the Boneheads overall weren't that bad. It was just particularly on that bloody block one, wasn't it? Um, I hate that you can't read anything into that. The block dice didn't feel great, but weren't, weren't bad, were they? In fact... Probably is good actually. Didn't fucking hurt anyone. That was the that was the killer. We just had eleven people. Yeah, yeah. He did struggle against the ball. Yeah, I couldn't do anything. Well, I got got one. I mean, <laughs> the ogres were just struggling with themselves, weren't they? Rolling fucking ones. <laughs> like I just couldn't get anyone back to deal with them because they fucking kept going stupid. Pretty annoying. But, I mean, that's all because, isn't it? All right, Shawnee leveled up with his with his getting hurt. Um, <laughs> yeah, I think it was the other way around. All because, man. All right, let's have a look. Agility. <laughs> I don't even know whether to take it or not. I honestly don't know whether to take it or not. Um, Just because you've got break tackle if you want to dodge with him, you know? So it would only be for picking up the ball and stuff. Being a ball-carrying ogre. Being a ball-carrying ogre is more dependent on sure hands than agility, really. Uh, is J5 just a normal... Normal miss next game? Yep. So... 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So I'm going to have to buy another Snotling for the next game. But, what a day. What a day with the Brogas. Unbelievable. Take it or riot. <laughs> GFI, what were, the, what were the GFIs like? I just realised that uh, the other day, I, you know, someone said it in chat. Um, but the get fucked idiot is GFI, isn't it? I feel like I should have a GFI emote. Um... <laughs> it can mean get fucked idiot. G five seventy six. Oh, they were. I did make a lot to be fair, but then snotlings are fucking slow, aren't they? So it's. Uh... <laughs> yeah, four four one zero ogres. Pretty good. Um, <laughs> thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe, and stay fantastic. <laughs>